Okay, let's continue with Fliss. Seriously, weird shit going on here. Internal memo. To all field officers, the scale of our search and recovery missions across the area have yielded results far greater than expected. Unfortunately, there is now a shortage of adult caskets. If you locate the remains of any missing persons at the water purification plant, you may have to use smaller caskets. I guess I'll have to take have to have to be Hawkins. I guess I'll have to be Hawkins, poor bastard. There's almost nothing left of him. I know the same type deal, guys. But they'll give him a proper funeral and respect he deserves once we've got his body back home. We'll just have to make this work for now. Okay. Interesting. Must have been one of those, uh, what do you call it, untimely deaths? Jesus! Come on! Okay, it looks interesting. You said it. Unless I'm wrong. Or is it Danny? Stay back! I mean it! Hey, 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 listen to me. Take a deep breath, okay? Nobody's gotta get hurt here. Just back I'm off. Backing off. Okay? Just calm down. Don't! Don't! They'll release. Is that water pressure in there? Easy! Easy! Oh, hell no! Come on! To regret that. Yeah. Button tie. No, damn it. Oh, come on. Seriously, I'm pressing these buttons. What the hell? Get the cap first! Cap first! Cap! No! No! God! Stupid! Oh, my reactions are terrible right now. Come on! Get together! Come on! Get together! We need the cap or we're done! Get the cap! Right. Not yet, not yet. We need the cap first. Not yet. No, not yet. We need the cap. You gotta get out now. now. Shit, we need the cap. 
Oh, come on! Oh, you're serious. The button masher can't do it in time, half the, half of it. I, that's like I actually don't like about this game. The button scheme. It, I don't know. That's just, I don't no. like that. I really don't, I'm sorry. No. No. Right. Oh, well, that's it. We'll just have to rely on whoever it was to send help. Oh, shit. Sorry, Fliss. The controls! It's the... Okay, I'll admit the one or two times the X or triangle, sure. But the button smashing! Like... You're supposed to spam the bloody thing, like, at half the time, you literally have like three or four seconds, and it takes two seconds for your brain to queue in, and by that time it's already too late. Whoa. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. That's awful. Sorry. That's a really bad downside about this game. No! 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 Poor Brad. Sorry, mate. To be fair, it's not like we could try and hold on to anything. He just fell and lost balance. So that's not technically our fault. The game did that to us, actually. So... And I think... I think... Alex is the only one left. I think. 100% sure on that. <clears throat> I suppose at least someone survived, hopefully. Mourn. I totally get it. Sorry I couldn't save your friends. Blend a game for that, quite honestly. At least for a couple of them, anyway. Sorry, Julia. I should have chosen not. I should have chosen a psychology of any other room. I should have done. That was my fault. I will admit that. Completely. Is that who I think that is? Uh, Conrad. Okay, we don't need to see his face. Oh uh, well. That was... I tried to, I tried to save him. I'll, I'll, I, I had to, I, I mean that. I just couldn't press it fast enough. Damn it. Now, I will be the first one to say, confess, I should have done better with Fliss. I should have. Yes. The button smash, that's something, I don't know where I could do to hold. But, um... <clears throat> did... <coughs> Yeah, well, kind of had to be unless there was some magic way to kill him. <laughs> you and I had to have a talk, curator. Seriously. That's it. Game over. You're done. For now, at least. You could always try again, see if you can't do better next time around. Not a very happy ending. Or maybe it is. 
Depends what? Depends what makes you happy, really. God, you're dark, aren't you? I suppose when the curtain falls, you're either ready for it or you're not. True. Very true. And the distributor cap? Yeah, well, we should have grabbed that. We should have grabbed that. Unfortunate. Yep, certainly was. It's all about decisions, isn't it? Decisions made in a hurry, in a panic, made True. with the heart instead of the head, or vice versa. Absolutely, unfortunately. Sometimes those decisions take a long time to have repercussions. Yep. But there are repercussions. There are always repercussions. That's straight true. Most of the time, anyways. Till we meet again. Maybe in Little Hope. Maybe somewhere else. But be certain. We will meet again. It's inevitable. Okay. Because this is an anthology, so I'm wondering if Little Hope's the next game. That's what I'm Won't wondering. Won't you spare me over till another year? Won't you spare me over till another year? Won't you spare me over till another year? Won't you spare me over I'll skip the music just in case. Won't you spare me over till another year? Oh, 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 Anything oh. after credits? I heard that there was something, or is it going to skip it? <clears throat> Just for the whole music thing, it's just gonna... Because I do want to talk about this game a bit, and I'd rather not have... Oh! Oh, it's a helicopter! Must be a rescue helicopter! <sighs> oh, wow! Hey, hey! Target confirmed as the Orang Medan. We found her, boys. This mission is certified level 3 classified. You know what that means. Wait, so they're gonna kill him? Military are right to kill the group in order to keep the sick. What? Oh, come on! Holy shit! What? <gasps> wow. Okay. <clears throat> huh. I just saw someone in the woods. Whoever it was, they're gone. Is this the next game? I fashioned her with my own hand. Oh, charming. Little Hopes, that's the next, must be the title of the next game then. <laughs> How about that? Stop, <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, unbelievable. <clears throat> I tell you what, despite the some things I didn't like, it actually is a good game overall. It actually is. Uh, the, the characters are actually quite good, you know, it starts off in a build up like the, the Until Dawn disc stuff, like very inno almost innocuous, like you don't expect much. And then, you know, little, and then things just start happening in a way it's like, well, could lead up to this, could lead up to that, you know. <clears throat> uh, that was, it, it did, it did intrigue me, you know, and I think. <laughs> as far as all the clues go, I, I reckon, as far as far as what I can remember and what we've read, I'd say that there must be some project, and 
those that the military didn't want anyone to find the ship, so they must have known how to distract the capability. Everyone died, so I think, oh, we can't risk this being brought to shore, so we'll let it become a ghost ship. And there's enough freaky shit that happens on board that it, it deters a lot of people. And I think they're using like a natural phenomenon to get people to leave, which I can understand that making a lot of sense then, you know? So, <clears throat> I reckon if there'd be more people, you know, or if Conrad survived, he might be able to bring help or something like that. We don't know, you know? If they'd gone, got distributed cat, we might be able to leave, you know? Conrad come back, maybe he'd been killed or scared to death. We don't really know, so it's it's possible. It's not really. Sh it's yeah. There's a lot of things that ifs or buts. Uh, I look. I really. I apologize for not keeping as many other people alive. There were some bad decisions I made, but as he said, Kuro said, you make decisions in the moment, and you use it sometimes based on experience and just use intuition, saying, "Oh, that might be the right idea." bad or good you live with the consequences and it's true i should have chosen the other room i should have got the distributed cap you know that button just super quick for me it's just it sometimes you just can't react fast enough <clears throat> now i don't remember honestly i don't remember whether the button smash was for the uh what do you call it the um <sighs> Actually, let's just have a look i'm just curious about something I want to see something because the controls were of uh, what do you call it? No, that's not what I meant to do. Huh. So I obviously couldn't do that. Okay. <clears throat> so obviously that's just designed its specific way. That's one thing I really didn't like. I mean, I understand the you know, the button, you know, tapping, but, <clears throat> you know, you shouldn't have to, in this situation, be smashing the bloody thing, especially in a really tense situation where just has a jump scare, and then suddenly out of nowhere, you have to do a button smash, and half time, you are not prepared for it, and it will fail, you know, and I, look, I understand if there's the button tapping, but not smashing, if that makes any sense, like, you should have to, you know, you know, really just, you know, have to tap it as quick as you can, maybe, I don't know, four or five times, if you get what I'm saying. Instead of having to, you know, one of those little build-up circles, you have to really smash it hard, you know? And it's just one that, you could probably keep just going, you know, because I was smashing a bloody thing, you know? Cause, and that takes away from the enjoyment. I get there's a stress in it, but at the same time, it's like, Why? You know, it's not necessary. Because it takes... Because it means you can't be in the moment of... It's like, oh, God, it's jump scare. And it's like, oh, shit. Now you have to actually get and start smash your controller. That's not necessary. I really hope they don't do that next game. Or I might not play it. Because you shouldn't have to be smashing. I mean, I understand the quick tapping uh, four or five times. A quick, like, oh, quick. And just making it. But we have to sit down actually press the damn thing. I mean... I actually had to hold the control in one hand with the other finger, I had to smash the button half the time. That's how I did, I couldn't, I wasn't quick enough the other time. I don't like that. You never had to do that until dawn. You know, if there was a, <clears throat> an until dawn, I can't remember whether you had to hold the button to stay hidden or whether you had to put the left control stick and actually move it in a certain direction, I think it was one of those two or both combined. You didn't have to... <clears throat> Uh, especially now, especially with the heartbeat, right? Now, okay, I admit I'm not the best at that quick timing, but they could have made it so that it was, you know, it was, it, so, it, if that makes sense, like, you know, it's timed, you know, not just, you know, da -da, you know, tap, 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 super quick, they can, just should be, you know, progressive, but it's, you know, maybe one or two seconds apart, or two seconds apart, or one and a half. So you have to have some timing, but it's not too stressful. Because the thing is, the stress is, you know. The stress is already there that you know these people are going to catch you. So the stress is you're thinking, and you'll be timing in your mind. Oh, press it now. Press it now. 
suppress it now. The stress is there. They don't need to amplify it anymore. It's. I'm sorry. I just. It could have. It could have changed a whole bunch of things. You know. I didn't mind that. Uh, one or two times we did fail. We had to run. I understand that. But when you do it, you know, there's such quickness. It's like. Yeah, it, 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 it frustrated me. It's like, well, that's not why I'm playing the game for that. It's not. But anyways, you know, when you take that away, just look at the game itself for the story. I did enjoy that, you know. The curator, he was definitely in that game. He was definitely in the background. I must count four, five times. You've got some explaining to do, curator. You really do. <laughs> But anyways, uh, we'll end it here. So, it's a new game. I'm going to be starting a playthrough of either tomorrow or the day after, whichever. So, uh, it's actually a game I have been playing uh, in between recordings. I've just been doing stuff. So, it's a game that has really surprised me. Uh, this has surprised me for both good and bad. Um, but I'll talk about the other game when I start it. Uh, it's a, you know, it's one of those, uh, not, not career playthrough, um, <laughs> progressive playthroughs, that's one of the words. <laughs> so, that'll be really enjoyable. So, it's certainly a lot different to this, so I hope you'll enjoy it. But anyways, I'm going to end this here. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. I know we couldn't save everyone, but at least we saved someone with something, I suppose, at least. <laughs> Uh, God, that was stressful. Holy shit. Uh, thank you all for supporting this series. Whichever way you have. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll catch you next time for a brand new Let's Play. Take care.